Debbie. Okay. So how do you feel today? You're looking great. I feel okay. Okay. I'm happy for the bride and the groom. Yeah, you should. Okay. Uh huh. And let's get this show on the road. Okay. All right. Short with words. So long. I started to believe I'd never find anyone. Doubt to try to convince me to give in. Said you can't win. But one day the sun came shining through. Rain had stopped and the skies were blue. And oh, what a revelation to see. Someone was saying, I loved you to me. I found a piece of happiness to call my own And life is worth living again For to love you to me is to live Oh Passion and sent to me a stroke of love called you a one in a million you a What's your assignment here today, ma'am? Well, um, I got the bride here. You did? Yes. Okay. So how do you feel? I, I feel blessed. Mm -hmm. As you blessed should. It's a momentous occasion. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I feel. Say that again. I said that's how I feel. Blessed. Yeah. Yeah. So you looking at that dress, you are blessed. <laughs> <laughs> or you are. <laughs> Ooh. I would just Responsibility to get him here. He is here and ready. Amen. My job. Yes, sir. Is fulfilled. Yes, sir. Well, not quite. Still got to. All right. So I, I don't know if I'm supposed to introduce myself. 
I am the son of the bride, uh, son-in-law of the groom. Um, I do, you know, just want to echo, echo that um, I am appreciative of everyone showing up and showing love um, and support for both of these two wonderful people. Um, this point in time, you are two of the most important people, not only in my life, but in other, uh, in the rest of the family. You guys represent pillars um, upon which uh, the red foundation rests. And, uh, so we just look to you guys, not only uh, for support, but we look to you guys uh, for opportunities to, to show our love and support you as well. And so I just say all that to say that this is a monumental uh, day and event tomorrow. I don't want to undermine it uh, just because it's not a huge event with thousands of people. Um, but it's intimate with the most important people being present. Um, we always praying for you. We thank God for you. Um, we just love and appreciate you. Um, I'm just happy she's happy, okay. and I'm just praying that this is a lifetime Amen. commitment, and that he treats her right, and she treats him right. Yeah. So if she's happy, hey. Good. How are you today? Good. 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 Who's getting married that you know? Uh, he, my grandma. Your grandma. You want to tell her anything? I love you. Is that it? You're short with words. I know you're short, but you don't want to be short with words. Well, I'm not short. You are short. You ain't taller than me. Not yet. Because you're a grown man. Okay, you got, okay, let me come down here. All right, you have anything to say, though? I'm happy for Jesus. Not yet? No, so I feel good. What do you got to say to the bride and groom? I just want to uh, thank everybody for coming and have a good time. TJ, oh, man, look at He just TJ real quick. So how do you feel today, man? Good. All right, so who's getting married that you know today? Uh, my second oh, second. Oh, your grandmother. Yeah, okay, cool. Grandma. Cool, cool. So how do you feel about it today, man? I love it. As long as she's happy, I'm happy. My man. You know, that's the warning. Her happiness is my happiness. Man, you don't know who Superfly is, but that's what you are right now. Show up there, man. How you feel today? Got that crispy cut. Who's getting married? Your auntie? Your sister? Uh, my, your cousin? My grandma. Your grandmother. Okay. That's your grandmother, huh? That's what they tell you. All right. <laughs> All right, so how you feel? I feel good, okay, Maxwell. Christian, what's up, buddy? Christian, you have anything you want to say? What do you want to say? Robin. Robin, hi. You look so beautiful today. Thank you. Who's getting married that you know? Gigi. Gigi? Who's that, your auntie? No. Who's that? My granny. Oh, your granny. Okay. You want to say anything special to your granny? No. <laughs> no. Okay. Well, how about you find something to say? Go ahead. No. no. Five. Four. GG, I love you so much. Oh, I did not even have to get to one. Just be my lady And everything will be alright Just be my lady I love you every day and night Just be my lady I promise you that everything will be all right. 
Of all. 
want to say best wishes to you guys. We love you. And uh, many, many years of blissful. Just uh, um, God's blessings on okay. you. Okay. All right. Mariah, have anything you want to say? Um, I know that Angela is a very um, happy person and that she needs somebody like, like equally as happy. So I think that she wouldn't have chose nobody else okay. other than him. Okay. All right. Look at the words of wisdom. How are you ladies doing today? You guys, Hi, how are you? Good, thank you. You guys have anything to say to the bride and groom? I just want to say congratulations and just wish them a lifetime of love and happiness. There you go. And I want to say congratulations to my sister. Love you so much. Yeah. And wish you blessings for you and Abner to yeah. 50 years or more. Come on, man. All Come right. on, man. How you doing today? Good to see you. Have anything to say to the bride and groom? God bless your marriage. Oh, look at that. Forever and always. Family, you have anything to say? Congratulations, cousin. Oh. Love you. Congratulations, brother. Woo! You want to say something to the bride and groom? Congratulations. Congratulations. Wish you many years of happiness and joy. Amen. Right, this young lady right here, right, I'm, let me come around. I'm going to come around. As you know, she got something. She's wiping her fingers off and everything. Right? <laughs> Congratulations to you. Oh, I wish you many, many, many years of happiness. Amen. Oh, what well, she said. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. And I say congratulations also. And I know you'll never know. Happy as a life. Yes, ma'am. And your joy. I'm so very happy for you. Congratulations. May God bless okay. your marriage. May love reign in your home forever. And I hope that your marriage lasts for years and years and years. God bless you. Amen. 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 to be prepared. <laughs> The Holy Spirit lead me. <laughs> there you but go. I just want to tell you guys that I love you very, very, very much. I just thank God that you were both believers. I thank God that you, He brought you guys together. Everybody know that it started here right now. Mark your calendars. Brand new beginning. Awesome couple. And let's just toast them together. Amen. I do not, I do though. I do not, but I do. Okay, so we'll do I get it back a little bit. Thank you, sir. So, today was a wonderful day. Uh -huh. It was a blessing to be here to celebrate with all these people the love that Auntie has and her joining this happening together. That's so beautiful. Uh -huh. That's all I got to say. I can't wait to see more here. It's really good. It's been uh -huh. forever. It's been over 15 years. Uh -huh. You better have this on too. Oh, yeah, let me on. Uh -huh. <laughs> nah, it's on. It's on. You got it. I know you play too much. Yeah, I However, got you. It was a freaking blessing to be here. And an honor. Yes. And the cameraman. You held it down as usual. Bam. Come back. Oh. Thank you for inviting me. I didn't invite you. Oh, oh, look to the camera. Go ahead. Go ahead. Hey, okay. <laughs> well, you already spoke to the bride and groom, right? That's it. What'd you say? Said I feel good about this. Well, it ain't about you. <laughs> Not me. Not me. Just wish them the very best. We've been married 50 years. Amen. So we hope they reach 50 also. Hey Amen. That's yeah. what I'm talking about. I love are, it. There are some stories that we could tell about Abner because we've known him probably for at least 65 years. Woo! But we're gonna we're gonna hold those back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For yeah, yeah. another time. I mean, we got a lot of tape. Yeah. <laughs> well, Joyce is such a nice person. We just yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, to uh, Joyce and Abner. Uh, I've known you all for quite a while, and um, best wishes, and I have hope you keep the love that you have now, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Words of wisdom. No, I don't have anything to say. Congratulations. Hey, to, to the bride. Look, come on. When you don't have anything to say, congratulations. Ma'am, I didn't hear you, ma'am. I said congratulations. Hey, Joyce and Abner. Okay. They right over there. Nah, just playing. Okay. <laughs> happy, just happy for you. Yes, ma'am. You think you want to say to the bride and groom, sir? Just enjoy life. Enjoy. I love it. I wish love you it. all the love. Amen. Congratulations, Amen. Joyce and Anther. We go a long way back. Yeah, yeah. 
That's it? I said she eat, she go cut it short. Okay. Yeah, the food is good. Bam. Congratulations, it was a beautiful ceremony. Bam, short and sweet. See, she ready to get back to that place. Congratulations to my uh, new first cousin and her husband. Congratulations, Joyce. May the good Lord bless you and have many, many years of happiness. Hey, Amen. Wonderful. Blaze, you got anything you want to say, buddy? Blaze, say chicken, 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 chicken. Yeah. <laughs> what do you want to say to the bride and groom? Thank you so much. We had a good time. We appreciate your business. Right here? Yes. Uh, Hold on, I got to make sure ain't nothing much. Right. Right? You got some green stuff right there. <laughs> no, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, wait, let me record it. No, it's good. Uh, it's going to miss her, Abner and Miss Joyce. Congratulations on your matrimony, and thank you. Yeah, it was an honor to be here. Bam. Just like that. Good luck in this one. Hey, Amen. Yes, definitely. All of it. Congratulations, hey, Joyce and Abner. I know it's been a long time coming, but I wish you all the best, and God's blessing. Hey, Amen. Abner, good luck to you. when Joyce's family described her as the pillar of their family. Joyce, you are one in a million, a chance in a lifetime. Yeah, yeah buddy. Yeah, a chance in a lifetime. Abner and Joyce, yeah, isn't the world buddy. a crazy place? Just when you thought your chance had passed. <laughs> You're going to save the best for last. Congratulations, Abner and Joyce. Cheers, folks. Raise your glasses. Cheers to All the bride right. and To the bride and groom. How y'all doing today? Good night. I'm doing well. Good to see y'all. Look, y'all looking good over here and everything. Everybody got lotion on and everything. Look at that. We, we clean up so well, though. To the bride and groom, Joyce and Abner, I am so incredibly excited when you were walking down brought tears to my eyes. Aww. And so when God has that kingdom spouse for you, it cannot be denied. So Come on. To God be the glory, God's blessing on you too, now and forevermore. God bless. Hey, hey, man, she just freaked. Anybody got that one? <laughs> take it, take it, take it off. Yeah. Yeah. Us to you guys, I told you after this was going to happen, I have been praying for you and no, George no. for a long time. And to God be the glory, because you have found your good thing. Hey, okay. Right. Oh, Congratulations right. and best wishes. Oh, man. Wish you the man. best, guys. I'm here for you if you need me. Amen. Congratulations. Amen. I love you both. I wish you all of the happiness in the world. All right, let me, wait. let me hear record. Yeah. I got to hear record. I 
Christ and declared by St. Paul to be honorable among men. It is not therefore to be entered into without holy advice or lightly, but reverently, soberly, advisedly, and in the fear of God. Let us therefore, under the seriousness of this act, invoke divine presence upon the occasion. Bow your heads with me. Almighty God, the King Eternal, from whom all proceeded all power and dominion, both in heaven and on earth. We humbly beseech thee to look with favor upon thy servants, this man and this woman. Be thou the honored guest at this wedding to turn the water into wine of joy. Grant unto them the assurance that they have been brought together by thine providence, so that they may be truly and eternally joined together by the Holy Ghost. We pray this through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Let the house say amen. As you stand here in the presence of God to remember that true love and faithful observance of your marriage vows are required as the foundation of a successful marriage and the establishment of a happy and enduring home. Without these things, there could be no real marriage. And the home which you will endeavor to establish will be a vain effort. Keep the solemn vows you are about to make to each other. Live with tender consideration for one another. Conduct yourselves honestly and in truth, and your marriage shall last. Your home will be lasting. This commitment to marriage will be a blessing to you both, and you will be a blessing to others. This should be remembered as you now desire to be united in holy wedlock. Now we get to the nitty gritty. Sir Abner, repeat after me. I, Abner, no, 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 let's back up. Abner, do you take this woman to be your wedded wife? And do you honestly promise before God and these witnesses that you will love her, comfort her, honor her, and keep her in sickness and in health, and that forsaking all others for her alone? You will perform unto her all the respect that a husband owes his wife until death shall separate you. Your response is, I do. All right. Now to you, Lady Joyce, do you take this man to be your wedded husband? And do you earnestly promise before God and all of these witnesses that you will 
love him, comfort him, honor him, obey him in sickness and I split that in there real quick. That's right. Obey. She heard it. She heard it. Okay. Everybody heard it. She is going to obey. In sickness and in health and forsaking all others for him will uh, perform unto him all the duties that a wife owes to her husband. Unto God by death shall separate you. Your response is, I do. <laughs> Therefore, since it is the agreement of Abner and Joyce to be husband and wife, they've already joined their right hands. We will commence with the wedding vows. Repeat after me, please, Abner. I, Abner Norman, I, Abner Norman, take thee, Joyce Elliott, to be my wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, and to love and to cherish, till death do us part, according to God's holy ordinance, and thereto I pledge thee my faith. It's real. <laughs> Lady Joyce, I, Joyce Elliott, take thee, Abner Norman, to be my wedded husband, to have and to hold, from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do us part, according to God's holy ordinance, and thereto I pledge thee my faith. Uh -huh. May I have the rings, please? Now, for those in the back, y'all can see these are beautiful matching bands. Oh, baby, thank you so much. I got you. I got you. I got you. <laughs> good job, Christian. Christian is doing a good job, y'all. This ring bearer is on his post. Thank you. As we see, these rings are a complete circle. There is no break, there is no separation between them. A complete round circle. Symbolic of the love that you, should, you two share for each other. Symbolic of the union that you two are creating together. There is no break. There is no discontinuation. There is no pause in these rings. Now I'll pray over these rings. As I understand, they hold a very significant value, not only as your symbols of union, but as symbols of your faith and as symbols of your walk with Christ. Father God, we bless you for these rings. We thank you and praise you for the union that they represent. We thank and praise you for this continuous circle, God, for this, this continuous union, God. We are asking for your strength. We are asking for your endurance to bless this couple as they endure into this thing called marriage. These and other blessings we ask in your son named Jesus, we pray. Thank God. Amen. Amen. Wonderful. Told you they was a matching set, so I couldn't tell. And I wasn't that bright because I didn't realize his was much larger than hers, so they had to help me out a little bit. Now we're coming out to the rings. Abner, take your ring. Lady Joyce, give him your ring finger. Yeah. 
place it on that first joint on that thing. Don't slide it all the way through there. Slide it up there, just be good. Now, for as much as me, Abner and Joyce have consented together in holy wedlock and have witnessed before God the same in this company. You slide this ring to that joint, you look at her and say, Joyce, with this ring, I be wed. Joyce, in the same fashion, take that ring from Cherie. Slide it to Abner's ring finger. Look it into those brown eyes of his, and I want you to say to that man, Abner, with this ring, I be wed. You have given rings and received rings with the joy of the Lord, it being our strength. Y'all know what? I actually have the privilege of pronouncing you husband and wife. So at this point in time, Abner, you may salute your bride. God, I now present to you the Mr. and Mrs. Abner Norman. Let's celebrate! Like that's what you 